group here, and this is the September, no August, sorry, the August Nihon box, which was Summer Quest. It says, uh, Discover Japan through best otaku and traditional items, packed with love in Tokyo. Share your Nihon box, you know, with Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Summer Quest. That's what it is. That's the uh, uh, picture. It's got Naruto Kirby in the sign. And Tanjiro. So we'll just put that little poster off to the side. Oh, I got the uh, August 2020. That's what you could have won in the uh, lucky thing. That's um, a bit about the culture and cheat sheet. So let's just skip that bit. We got some uh, thank you for ordering this 20. 20 August box. Oh, that's kind of a spoiler, isn't it? Let's read that. Ooh, let's see. Uh, got some. Is it lemon? Oh, lemon mochi. I personally hate the lemon flavor. But I'll try one. I don't like it. I'll give it to my brother. He likes mochi. Okay, it's a Kirby Frisbee, which you'll find on my eBay. Got some Dragon Ball Z cards. Dragon Ball acrylic card. Interesting, it's got the two-way animation thing, so you can blind. Cheetah. That's interesting. I mean, I like crook stands and all. It's got a little circle up here so you can actually make it into a keychain as well. That was pretty cool. Um, it's got a little box. That's pretty cute. Hang on a sec. Put it back in here for a moment. We've got this. I have no idea what it's for. But it's pretty cool. And 
my Naruto in the Shippuden section. Kakashi, Sasuke, and Sakura in the back. I have no idea what it's for, though. I'll look at the cheat sheet after and we'll see what it is. Okay, this is the very compressed Rimuru. I'll look at what it is before I open it. It's like, it's very compressed. <laughs> We have reached the end of the box. Uh, it says XL, so I'm guessing it's a t-shirt. Kimetsu no Yaiba, which I've seen, Demon Slayer. And it is Tanjiro. T-shirt. I don't mind. Prefer like the Demon Slayer item was actually item, item, than a t-shirt. But still, it's pretty cool. I can use it as a night shirt when it's hot. Um, Okay, Demon Slayer commits to have a t-shirt, Tanjiro Kamado. As you have already noticed, we are big fans of Demon Slayer and the team, and we actually well, actually, it's quite difficult not to be here in Japan. Not a day goes by without seeing goodies and products featuring the characters in the supermarkets, in the streets, etc. It's a cool t-shirt, perfect for summer, featuring Tanjiro alongside the character Metsu, which means destroy. Nice. Okay, then we've got Kirby Ruth. Whether playing on the beach or in your backyard, while on vacation, or even to decorate your home, here's official Kirby Frisbee. Kirby fits perfectly in this round Frisbee shape. Kirby has been very popular in Japan lately, with the newly opened Kirby themed cafe in Tokyo, pop up shops, and lots of goodies coming out every month. Personally, it's not really my favorite thing, but still. Okay, next up, we've got this cool acrylic D card. It's basically an acrylic stick. I guess you could call it an acrylic card too. Um, features characters from, of Dragon Ball with a small acrylic card. The originality of this collection is that the character can also become small figurine. There are less than 50 characters available and random in your box, including some of the quite original ones. So unfortunately, no uh, Son Goku or Gohan or, you know, but this is one of the original of the characters, Vegeta. I think my brother likes it. But I don't know if he'd actually really use it. And then I could give it to him for his Christmas present, but would he use it? That's the question. And it doesn't even like Dragon Ball anymore. Yeah, because like his, uh, him and my brother were like really big fans when they were younger, and my other brother's nickname, uh, my other brother called him was Kakarot. I don't know why. Yeah, I really don't know why. But actually, I might give this to him for his Christmas present because I don't have anything at the moment, and I only was recently told he's gonna come out, come home for Christmas this year, <laughs> even though he's in the states right now. Anyway, 
Next up. This thingy is called a Furin Kingyo. This is one of the most iconic summer related objects in Japan. This traditional shrine usually hung over doors and windows that evokes freshness and summer breeze for many Japanese, mostly due to the sound it makes when it rings. It, this one represents a Kingyo goldfish, it's also another symbol of summer. Though currently, September and almost winter. There's an autumn first. Autumn first, yes. It feels like winter with all the rain, cold. Yeah. Anyway, now we can figure out what this thing is. Let's see, it is Tower Stand, Naruto Shippuden. Naruto is back in the Nihon box with a useful product. The tower stand will be very handy to display pens or small accessories with Naruto featured on the side and the software fashion is also on the other. Your desk never looks so good. Actually, I could probably use this. That is very handy. Okay. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Let me open it for you, shall I? Give a better look to the outside. There's one thing over there. Nice. Very, very nice. And second to last, we have the Satoshi Lemon Monaco. This is it. Um, another tasty treat is featured in your box this month with its Lemon Monaco. Monaco is a traditional Japanese pastry made of two wafers and filled with a sweet dough. Often made from red beans, these ones are lemon from Satoshi, a region well known for its lemon production. We strongly suggest you taste them along with a good cup of tea as in, as in Japan, Japanese tea houses. Personally, I don't really like tea. I'm still trying to find a good strawberry one. Let's try it, shall we? Oh boy. Okay, so actually, hang on. I need to take a picture first. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Uh, uh, reread this little, little bit again. It is two wafers filled and filled with a sweet dough. Okay, it's the lemon flavor. So let's. Well, I can't say I, uh, I'll try almost everything else since I actually can't eat it. So let's, let's have a go. Okay, it's gonna be interesting. But the wafers kind of feel like styrofoam. Mm. It's, like it doesn't taste lemon. But it's not as strong as I thought it would be. Inside texture is so weird. 
No, that's what my brother. My brother wants to try one. I don't know if he actually tried one before. I mean, I wouldn't go and buy it again because I don't like lemon. It might be different if it was strawberry flavor. Um. I don't know. I'm tempted to say it's supposed to kind of like have a uh, refreshing feel after. I don't know. No, I think all the flavors in the middle gooey, doughy bit. the way from really tastes of anything. Maybe it's like more people than I just think off the feeling that it tasted like something. But anyway. Ocean blue color. This removed Tempest plush. It's a plush. The main character of the rainbow. Add a summer touch to your collection. It's mochi mochi texture. Is sure to make you addicted to this lovely character. Oh, I do love the mochi mochi. Like, it's like when I have my rabbit thing over there. I think I'm a mochi in the form. This this one too might be as well. Sort of this guy is as well, I think. Like Carol from the car covers. Okay, I'm gonna put this down slightly so I can cut it open. Well, you can definitely say that they know how to pack plushies in here. Because I look at it, it looks totally flat. You know, when the oxygen is added. Hopefully it won't puff up like it's supposed to. Ooh, it's good. Definitely immediately puffed up. That's how I'm going to Let's walk it up. Oh, it's so cute. Now I can show you. Look, it's properly puffed up. Anyway, 
There, this is his happy. Anyway, that's it. So thank you for watching. I can talk more. I think that notifications are over now.